Once upon a time in a small town, there lived a boy named Timmy. Timmy was a kind-hearted boy, but he often felt shy and found it challenging to make new friends. He spent most of his time alone, playing with his toys in his room. One day, Timmy's teacher, Mrs. Johnson, noticed that he seemed a bit lonely during recess. She decided to help him improve his social skills, knowing that making friends was an essential part of growing up. Mrs. Johnson gathered all the kids in the class and introduced a special project called the Friendship Challenge. The goal of the challenge was to encourage everyone to make new friends and learn the importance of good social skills. To start the challenge, Mrs. Johnson asked the kids to pair up with someone they didn't know very well. Timmy hesitated at first, but then partnered with a girl named Emma. They were given a list of activities to do together, like sharing a favorite toy or drawing a picture as a team. As Timmy and Emma worked on their activities, they started talking and laughing. Timmy discovered that Emma liked dinosaurs, just like he did. They quickly became friends and began spending more time together during recess. The only way to have a friend is to be one. Ralph Waldo Emerson The friendship challenge continued throughout the week with different pairings and fun activities. The kids learned how to listen, share, and understand each other better. Communication is the key to personal and career success. Paul J. Meyer and Mrs. Johnson also taught them the magic words, please, thank you, and I'm sorry. These simple words made a big difference in how the kids communicated with each other. Politeness is the flower of humanity. Joseph Joubert Timmy's confidence grew, and he felt more comfortable talking to others. He realized that having good social skills wasn't just about making friends. It also helped him express himself and understand different points of view. At the end of the day, the most overwhelming key to a child's success is the positive involvement of parents and teachers. Jane D. Hull At the end of the week, Mrs. Johnson gathered the kids to talk about their experiences. Timmy shared how the friendship challenge had made a positive impact on his life. Friendship is born at that moment when one person says to another, What? You too? I thought I was the only one. C.S. Lewis other kids also expressed how much fun they had and how they made new friends they never thought they would. A real friend is one who walks in when the rest of the world walks out. Walter Winchell The town noticed a positive change in the atmosphere as kids started playing together more and adults also participated in community events. The friendship challenge had not only improved social skills among the kids, but also created a friendlier and more connected community. Timmy's story teaches us that learning social skills is like unlocking a treasure chest of friendships and connections. Simple acts of kindness like sharing and listening can make a big difference in our lives and remember, the magic words, please, thank you, and I'm sorry, are the keys to opening that treasure chest and building strong and lasting relationships.